All right, let's try this again. Uh, so what's up? I'm gonna be taking a look at the Sony uh, WHCH510s. These are some Bluetooth headphones. So they're wireless. And let's look in the back here. It says uh, music playback, time max. It says 35 hours, 10 minute charge. Plays up to 90 minutes. I don't know. I don't know what that means. Oh, okay. So 10 minute charge equals 90 minutes of music. Uh, swivels for a flat needs a portability. And the reason I got these, I got these um, on a, like a holiday sale. Um, and, you know, I, I do have some Galaxy Buds, but, you know, those are in the ear. And sometimes, they, you know, after wearing them for a long time, it gives you, it gives some discomfort. So I decided to get some over the ear and, you know, support like if I'm using headphones for a longer period of time, you know, they're a lot more comfortable and they don't, you know, this, you know, give me discomfort in my ear. So that's why I got them. Um, there are some Sony's, so they're like $30. So not that expensive. And, you know, I think it's worth it if you're just going to be, you know, for longer periods of time. Um, so, yeah. So let's take a look at this. Let me open it up. And I've, you know, I've had good experience with Sony headphones. I use those for my recording studio. But, you know, obviously the like the professional Sony headphones. Uh, they're quite comfortable. They've lasted me for a good decade, ten years. I'm still, you know, the 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 ear pad is a little worn out, but you know they still work. All right. So this, so pretty simple box. And that's it there's no special um special like package or anything like a little case there's no case for them these are just straight up the headphones and the reason i got these is when i first got them i thought it was gonna be micro usb i didn't really think about it but they're actually usb c so that's even better because I don't, I don't really like carrying extra cables and now i can just use the same cable for my phone and for the headphones so that's good and it does give you a little a little um, cable there it does not give you the actual brick it just assumes that you have it which I do have a lot but these are your headphones you could probably just like charge them on your on your um, laptop you know all right so these are pretty cheap Thirty dollars. I mean, these are not going to be a workout headphone. These are not going to be super uh, noise canceling or like, you know, super comfortable. I'm, I'm going to try them on. I mean, they're probably more comfortable than you know, what you call it, the in in the ear. I did used to have some Beats by Dre. Uh, I think some solos, and those like they really push on your ear. Well, the I like. The first generation ones and they really pressed on your ear so it, it did kind of like make your ear sore so maybe this one has enough flex that it doesn't like squish your your fit your ears so then I'm gonna try them on I have a big head so all right you can't see they're okay quite comfortable it does not press down on your ears so that's good so we have the bottom part there's a right here you have the let me move the lighting all right so we have the USB-C port um, we have the up and down here and then we have the power button in the middle there you go power button in the middle up and down and the USB C, and that's it. I know sometimes some headphones have like an option to make them wired just in case these do not give you the option. So let's see if they're let's see if I can pair them. Uh, where should I pair them? Um, I'll pair it in the on the on the iPhone. 
Let's see. So let's see if they're charged. Let's turn them on. I'm gonna push. All right, you have a little button. There's a light. All right, so let's go here. Bluetooth. <clears throat> All right, there they are. All right, so it says they're on. Let me wipe down the screen. All right, so I do have some power beats. They're not connected right now. So there's a WCH 510s. All right, let's listen to some music. Let me put it on. Let's see. What should I listen to? Let me go to the music. Let's listen to some. Let's listen to some M Protocol Survivalism. Uh, take us back to 2012. Uh, let's see uh, what song is let me let me try this one sentence obviously you can't hear it and no I'm not gonna sing along I just want to sound see how it sounds or hear how it sounds all right Let me turn up the volume. All right, it's definitely not the, there's no real bass to it. It is a little muffled. I mean, you can still like, it's still listenable. The highs, it's more mid, mid sounds. There's no high, high end or low end. It's more mid sounds, mid level sounds. I mean, it's still good. Like, uh, if you want to listen to to some podcasts, all right. So with beat with music, you're not gonna get the bass here. This one has bass. Let me see how it sounds with this with the bass. Actually, this one has a lot of bass. Dangerous Minds, let's see. This has Mad Bass, let's see. All right. All right, the bass is about to drop. Okay. Yeah. It has, uh, it, 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 you, can, you can hear the bass, but it is a little like, um, I don't even know what the word is, like muddy. It's not as clear as... Uh, my Seinheimers, uh, if I'm saying it right. All right, let's listen to some podcasts. Let's listen. Let's see how just pure vocals sound. Where's my podcast? Uh, here, let me look for my pod. Oh, there we go. Podcast. Let's see. Let's see. All right. All right, we're going to listen to some Stuff HD. Again, um, let's see how it sounds. All right, let's see how some other... Okay, the, uh, if it's pure vocals, it sounds good. So I think these are perfect for like listening to podcasts. Like if you're just gonna be like on a on a airplane or something, it's not gonna have noise noise canceling. Um, but you can like vocals sound good on this. I mean, good good enough. I can hear the breathing. All right, so so with from vocals it sounds good. Uh, with music, it's not the best, but you know for thirty bucks or what I paid, it's comf a lot comfortable than being in your ear. It's not gonna make your ear all like sweaty and stuff. And 
is pretty uh, flexible. It is plastic, so it's probably easy to break. Um, but yeah, if you get these for a, a, on sale, like $30, $20, I think these are a decent, decent get. So um, if you're looking into some of these, make sure like you don't pay the full price. <laughs> if you're paying more than $30, I don't think it's worth it at, um, you know, before tax. You know, so make sure it's under $30 before tax. So, yeah, that's about it. So definitely, and, and I'll be looking at these, like, using them more as I go. And I'll make an update um, to this video. All right.